Ryan Hughes on the roads. How are things looking out there, Ryan? Hi, Natasha. Good afternoon. Yeah, most of the people traveling this Thanksgiving, they will be driving and they are already on the move. We spoke with a lot of families that are going pretty far to be with their loved ones. And for some, this will be the first time that they're all together in years. Only a few hours into their four hour drive to Pittsburgh, Mike Beck and his parents hit a bump in the road with a blowout on the Pennsylvania Turnpike near King of Prussia. It's been better, but uh, a cup of coffee, a sandwich, and not AAA, and uh, we'll, we'll get there sooner or later. Their trip may take a bit longer from Center City, but they're still excited to see some family for the first time since the pandemic. It's hard to put into words, especially with, like we were just saying what it's been with COVID the last couple of years and how hard it's been not getting to spend a lot of time. So I treasure these moments even more. According to AAA, nearly 55 million people will travel for Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving, and despite gas prices being the highest they've ever been for the holiday, the majority of travelers are hitting the road to see loved ones. Well, because of the pandemic, we haven't seen our grandchildren in almost two years, so um, that's why we made this trip. Rich Brower has logged a lot of miles after leaving his home in Florida to visit relatives in Long Island and New Jersey. Quite honestly, you know, it's not going to bother me. I'm going to go make the trip regardless. I'd rather pay the gas. Then get on a plane and uh, fly. This is one of the busiest travel days of the year, but Trish Buecher is not in a hurry. She's taking her time to see her son and new daughter in law. We're going to be spending it with her family, which is also super. I got great in laws, I got a great daughter in law, so how cool is that? So, a lot of reunions happening this Thanksgiving. Right now, we're told that things are pretty calm, but traffic is expected to increase over the next couple of hours. That's on top of the normal evening rush. So, AAA says if you haven't left yet, your best bet is to wait until later on tonight or first thing in the morning. We are live near King of Prussia, Ryan Hughes, CBS 3, Eyewitness News. All right, good advice. Thank you very much, Ryan.